Okay, a little bit of a guest appearance here. It is Friday, the 25th of June, and this is Smokey. He's about almost 11 months now. He weighs 33 pounds. I put him on the scale at the dry cleaner yesterday, 33 pounds. And um, we just had a bath because he needed one. We were playing at a dog run that has uh, gravel on the ground, and he was in a tussle with a puppy uh, pit bull, all in fun. Um, named Olin. Anyway, uh, muggy, hot, sunny, summertime weather here in New York City. And um, just wanted to check in with the little guy here. He's doing great. He's got a little bit of a limp. I'm not sure what's going on. Uh, he had a scrape on his, uh, on his foot earlier in the week, which is healing up perfectly. But um, I, it might be that. If it doesn't get any better by next week, I'm going to uh, take him up to the vet see anything, but it's a tiny limp, and sometimes it looks more apparent than other times, um, but when he's in the heat of fun and play at the dog run, it doesn't seem to matter, I just don't want to, you know, exacerbate it by continuing to take him out, so if it doesn't get any better, I'm going to get it officially checked out by the vet. Um, let's see, digital recommendation, I don't know, I don't want to talk about the iPhone, and everyone in the world is talking about the new iPhone, I do not yet have the new iPhone, I didn't jump on the early registration uh, train, so I won't get one until the next wave of them is available, maybe later in July or August, but I'm not in any rush, but I have played with one and it is pretty sensational. Uh, what else, D digital recommendation, actually, you know what, the New York Times has an application called the Times Reader, which was built with Adobe Flash. Anyway, it's like subscribing to the paper, and you open this application, and you get the paper delivered to your computer or your laptop every morning. And so if you're traveling with your laptop, you don't have to be online to read it because it will have loaded into your machine. And it's called Times Reader. And it's like $15 a month. Um, the Times is going to start charging for access to their website anyway uh, by the end of this year or the beginning of next year. So the Times Reader is pretty fantastic, um, and uh, it's a great way to experience the paper. And plus, I've never been a fan of, you know, the paper paper. You know, it's dirty paper. It's a waste of trees, in my opinion, um, staying on topic with a digital recommendation. Um, so I love Times Reader. It's worth the 15 bucks a month. Um, and that is my digital recommendation of the day. I will have others perhaps over the weekend, but that's all she wrote. Bye-bye for now.